Hello, welcome to Horror and Monster Collectibles, where today we are going to be taking a look at this Auditor wall hanger. This is from the Hellraiser Judgment movie, and this piece was done up by Gary Tunnicliffe, who wrote and directed the movie. Uh, I am pretty excited to have this just because uh, I'm, while I'm not a huge fan of the movie, I did like the Auditor character, and I do have quite the collection now of Tunnicliffe's wall hangers and this will fit in with the bunch very nicely. Before we take a closer look, I just want to show you that the, uh, the certs that Gary includes uh, with all of his wall hanger busts. Um, really, I think that's the only thing I have from him. I think he does some masks and stuff too, but this is all I've ever gotten. Uh, and I have, again, quite the collection at this point, but I am happy to add the auditor to the wall of Hellraiser. Get this nice little card. Again, the auditor is not a Cenobite. He is a, an accountant for hell. The processes the souls of sinners, which I thought was really kind of like a cool idea. Uh, I did not, again, like the movie very much, but I did like this character and I feel like it would be kind of cool to see a backstory on him and him kind of developed a little bit further. And then finally we have a little fridge magnet. All right, so let's take a closer look at this. And again, this is made from the prosthetic makeup. And uh, in case you didn't know, Gary actually played the auditor in the movie. We have nice deep lacerations on here. which look really, really good. It has a nice metallic colors to the glasses here. There's a little taped piece. Now, we don't know what's behind here. I don't know if he has eyes. He probably doesn't have eyes. I wonder if they are sewn shut like butterballs. Be kind of curious to know what's behind there. That's kind of like the anarchy symbol right there. But this is really nice. Uh, they do such a good job on coloring this too. Uh, Every one that I get just has really, really nice paint detailing on here and just really, really cool modeling. Uh, I've never been disappointed with any of the pieces that I've gotten from him. But this is super cool. And this will look cool on the wall. Now I will say though, I feel like in the movie he had more kind of like blood on him from the, the lacerations. While there is some up on here, Feel like there was more in the movie maybe i'm just off this feels like a little bit like a cleaned up version of him and of course he had that business suit with like the blood staining on the white shirt on the back side we have auditor and of course 2020 gary tonicliffe and I, in here lately, he's been doing a deeper recess here for nails to hold on. I really like that he's been doing that. At least for me, uh, I've kind of noticed that. I don't know if he's been doing that forever, but the last couple of years I, I've noticed over that time period that this past year or so, eh, maybe just 2020, I've noticed a deeper recess there, which I really appreciate because I have a Cenobite um, wall hanger and he kind of wants to fall off a lot so I actually put some double-sided tape here to kind of grip the nail in the wall and keep it from moving but this looks rad super 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 rad and just real quick for you guys I wanted to throw them up on the wall uh, this is kind of where I have all the Cenobites at and for right now I just removed Chatterer so that you can kind of see what he looks like up on there. 
which I think he looks pretty darn cool. So I will get him a real position on the wall, but for now, here's what he looks like. All right guys, so that's about all there is to go over on this piece. I think it's pretty kick-ass. I really like the character, not so much the movie again. I know I've mentioned that a couple times, but eh. Uh, I'm curious to see what you guys thought of the movie. Um, I have a feeling most of you guys didn't care for it so much, but what did you guys think of the auditor? Because I really liked the character. I thought it was pretty cool, um, but I'm always curious to see what other fans of Hellraiser kind of think. There, there seems to be such a divide on what people like, what people don't like. Again, one of my top favorite Cenobites is the Surgeon, and not many people really even know him or like him that much but he's probably number three for me as my favorites with pinhead and chatter being one and two so as always feel free to leave any questions in the comments and i'll be happy to answer them and feel free to like and subscribe and click the bell for notifications for new videos until next time i'll see you guys later